Hey, what's up, guys? Um, it's your boy Zach. Um, it's a couple little videos I have to make for. Well, they're not little, but they're they're different. This is this is like a real life video, like. So, um, first, I know I'm late with this, and I haven't had the time to make a video about it, but, two of the most craziest, hardworking wrestlers in WWE history. Bray Wyatt and Terry Funk have both passed away. Now, some of you don't know Terry Funk that much, so maybe his death doesn't mean that much to you. But I known him from his ECW days, and he was a crazy, crazy wrestler. He used to go through tables, candlesticks, fire. He used to go through it all. He was like Mick Foley. He was like Mick Foley's brother or whatever. And Bray Wyatt, he was the um, the eater of worlds. He was I don't know the real name, so I'm just going to face off the But um, it really sucks. Like I enjoyed watching them both as a I enjoyed watching Terry as a child, and I enjoyed watching Bray as a teen and and an adult. And my condolences go to their families, and I pray every day. I'm going to pray every day for the family, and even though they're gone, even though they're passed away already, I'm going to pray for Bray and Terry. So, these guys were like friends to people. They are friends to people like John Cena, Hulk Hogan, The Rock, Stone Cold Steve Austin, R-Truth, Kofi Kingston, like all these people. They were special. Every superstar that passes away is special to the WWE. Not just because they're dead or they're passed away, but it's because they brought something to the WWE or AEW, whichever, whichever professional wrestlers die or pass away. Let me not say die because that's not the like wrestling. But like Bray was gonna be the next Undertaker. He was literally gonna be the new face of fear because the Undertaker's retired. And Terry Funk's already retired, but he's still he had some great matches with people like Sabu, Mick Foley, Robin Dam, The Sandman, Kevin Thorne, I think. I think he fought Kevin Thorne. Uh, a lot of people. I think even. I think he even faced Kurt Angle. I don't know. Uh, but, like, this might have been a disrespectful video, and I had no intention to make it disrespectful whatsoever. And I'm sorry if I did. But my condolences go to them. God bless them all. And it sucks to it sucks to hear that they're that they're passed away. Bray Wyatt of all people. I'm shocked. I'm most shocked about Bray Wyatt. Because like he's so young. The man's thirty six years old. Or he was thirty six years old. He just passed away. It sucks when people die. It, it, it just sucks, like, when everyone, like, Barry Wyatt, Barry Punk, Ultimate Warrior, Dusty Rhodes, um, Stan Lee, uh, Cameron Boyce, Juice World, Pop Smoke, XX Tentacion, uh, a lot of people, it sucks that a lot of these people die, like, they, they all meant something to the world. Anyways, guys, thank you for tuning into that, and yeah, there's gonna be another video, which is gonna probably be just as, a, just as emotional, 
it's not more personal. So yeah, take care.